they know that future brings you a new video so today we'll be looking at the hand of musician and actor chris brown so a very positive hand but there are some negative connotations as well so first of all we see that the fate line is coming from the wrist so this is very positive this means a person who is self-made uh, it means that a person who uh, is like from a very young age they have responsibilities and they uh, fulfill these responsibilities so from a young age the person's start to life is very positive and that they get all the benefits from luck so this is a very positive marking now if we see at here uh, around the age of 36 there is a change on the fate line the fate line is shifting the position so this means that he might venture out to new career path like maybe producing maybe going into acting again because he has already gone into acting before so there will be a change in the career path so this could be producing acting direction anything like this now let's go to the negative parts now if we see this hand we see that the headline is emerging from the lower mars mount now this shows anger this basically is a uh, especially uh, there is something to do with the age of 25 because that is when this uh, fate sorry headline uh, leaves the lifeline so this means that at that point of time there was some thing which happened i think the incident with rehana also happened around that time which i'm counting as 25 or 24 so maybe something happened during that time because we see this incident also marked on the heart line if we see the heart line is breaking at around 25 the same time the headline is leaving the lifeline so there must have been some issue or problem which might have happened at this age so this is what i'm seeing from the palm reading so again this doesn't mean that the person is angry all the time or goes into al al altercations with other people uh, it basically even the actor akshay kumar the bollywood actor also has a headline from lower mars but he has not been involved in any sort of mishap like the one with rihanna and chris brown so it doesn't necessarily mean that you if you have this headline you will also be uh, angry and stuff it just means aggression but it also has its positive side that it gives one very much energy so as he's also a good dancer so it's no surprise that he has so much energy because he uh, it all comes from the lower mars so lower mars is the idea of anger aggression but also the um, the one of uh, having the energy energy so energy also comes from there and physical energy especially comes from here so this is also very good also if we look at the mounts now if we see this is low, uh, lower mars so this is venus here we see venus is there and then venus is developed uh, upper mars is developed moon is developed apollo is developed and jupiter is developed so we see that this person has the capacity to be a good person he at heart is a good person because even if you see the heart line there's a break here but if we look at the heart line it's very long and it's starting from jupiter so with jupiter the person is very choosy and selective who they uh, fall in love with they especially fall in love with people who are more famous than them so this is also true for uh, him because he fell in love with Rihanna and he couldn't maintain the relationship with another person who was not that famous as Rihanna. So this is what uh, especially happened with him. So with Jupiterian heartlines, the people themselves are very uh, established. So they want someone as established or even more established than them. So there it is. Now if we talk about another awesome line, we see that the Mercury line is starting uh, from 25. Uh, as well so this means that uh, something happened uh, which got him a lot of money and fame not ne necessarily negative thing happened but positive thing happened and also if we see that the career is going on an upward path because the headline uh, sorry the fate line is also changing around that time it's changing at around 35 so there will be some positive connotations associated with it we also see this triangle is very strong this triangle is very large it's a great triangle so this means a lot of uh, positivity uh, and uh, financial benefits and we also see that the headline is of a good length it's medium it's not too long it's not too short this means this person is good with money and this uh, also it ends on upper mars this is the area of upper mars so this means this person is very mentally strong as well the upper mars mount is also very developed so this means this person is very mentally strong they are physically strong as well but mentally they're very strong and this why this is why he was able to bounce back from everything so he uh, served his time he did his time and then he b bounced back to his career so his career didn't take much of a fall so this is why because he has mental strength as well and if you look at the overall shape of the hand it's squarish so this means this person is very 
uh, hard working and if and practical and we see the headline it also shows practicality and if you look at the venus mount and moon mount it shows creativity and a luxurious life because when the venus and moon mounts are developed this means luxurious life is promised to the subject so this is very good next if you look at the thumb we see that the thumb is very long this also shows success and we see that both the logic phalange and uh, will phalange are balanced but if we see the logic phalange it's more straight than waist shape this means this person might uh, need some diplomatic uh, how do i say this like he needs to be more diplomatic in his life instead of straightforward that would bring him more opportunities uh, so even though his net worth is 50 million so that's 50 million dollars that's a huge net worth but he deserves it because he has all the makings he has an excellent freight line excellent mercury line excellent headline excellent heartline i would say the heartline is affect, afflicted a bit but overall if we see the lifeline as well we see that the lifeline is uh, getting giving more space to the venus mount so this means this person is uh, like get uh, giving more uh, to the uh, venus mount uh, meaning that this person is getting more extroverted as time goes by and then if we look at the uh, attachment line there is a attachment line here so this is actually an attachment line which shows the attachment with rihanna because if we time it is it it is in the mid 20s so that's around the time they got uh, involved with each other so this is there as well so if we look at the overall hand we see that this person is likely if, if the person is 34 so is likely to get married at 36 this is very likely to happen because the heart line is long and especially if we see that this person's Fate line is changing direction. So this means that when it changes direction, mostly the person gets married. So it's changing direction at 36. So most probably he'll get married at 36. So this is also likely to happen. And overall the hand, the mounts, almost all the mounts are developed. So that's good. Uh, luxurious living is shown. Uh, love of luxury is shown. Uh, uh, good heart is shown as the heart line is long and starting from Jupiter. Venus mount is uh, developed. This means that this person is very uh, passionate about, uh, he doesn't do anything without passion. And maybe that's the secret to his success. So uh, just like the rocks, Wayne Johnson, both of the Venus uh, and Moon mounts are developed. Even Leonardo DiCaprio has Venus and Moon mounts developed. So that shows luxurious living and also a person who gets married late in life. So overall, a very positive end. I can see the marriage happening at 36 and I can also see uh, more financial success happening at 36 as well. So thank you so much for watching and also for the person who recommended I read his end. Thank you so much. I really enjoyed reading his end. Guys, if you like this video, like it. If you love it, subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.